I'm Brian Mo Moses, and welcome to the Yeah Mad Rose Battle of America versus Australia. <laughs> yeah. Let's meet your opponents. As ladies first, everybody welcome Miss Paige Wesley. Yeah. Yes. And the Aussie. Everybody meet, what's Seth's name? Madison. 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 Madison? Madison. Madison? Madison. Yeah, Disgusting. <laughs> Folks, welcome to your Australian battle. It's Seth Madison. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful. Do you know what this is? No, I have no idea. We don't have these here. These. These are like it. Yes. Uh, this is a colonized person. Mm. <laughs> He's like me in, in our country. Oh. Yes. This is the whole continent versus the people that have been colonized. Are we ready for this? Yeah. 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 Are we ready? Yeah. Yeah. Let's roast. I'll go first, because we're number one. So, <laughs> it makes sense. Uh, Australia's main exports are country singers, Mel Gibson, and Fox News. You guys are better at American racism than we are. <laughs> I'd ask if you had the Klan over there too, but I'm pretty sure Bogans don't have clean sheets. <laughs> That's true. That's true. That's very true. <laughs> uh, I just want to say I'm Sri Lankan, so I don't give a fuck who wins this. <laughs> uh, I feel bad making fun of America. You know, it's uh, too way too easy. Uh, I think it's like making fun of the Down syndrome kid in class, you know? <laughs> With all your obese people, opioid users, and general idiots, being in America is like being in an episode of The Walking Dead. <laughs> With a lot less walking. <laughs> Americans are so dumb, they had to shorten it to USA just so they, just so they could spell it. <laughs> oh, I'm <laughs> <tarted. laughs> Are you American, dude? What's going on? <laughs> I think it's wild that you're calling us fat when you have a whole island named McDonald's. Um, <laughs> but honestly... Do we? Yeah, you do. <laughs> Fun fact, it's one of your prison detention centers. <laughs> you're welcome. Yeah. So it's the whole country. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, about four million of you are descended from people who were incarcerated by the British. And true story, in the 1800s, about 20% of the people they sent to prison in Australia were sex offenders. So putting a shrimp on the barbie is more of a threat. <laughs> Real talk. Australia, you might get on us for our loose gun laws. You have loose consent laws. Either way, we both love blasted kids in the face. <laughs> Uh, speaking of school shootings, I actually read in the uh, newspaper the other day there was a school shooting. They actually labeled this kid a terrorist, which is really crazy. Look, uh, white kids are not in the same league as terrorists. It's really hard to execute a terrorist operation on a plane, but it's really easy to execute a few kids. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I feel like you're speaking from experience? <laughs> uh, I actually read uh, 40,000 people last year died in America due to gun violence, which is far too low in my opinion. <laughs> uh, ironically, uh, obesity kills four times the amount of people that guns do in America. Uh, there really should be a march for that, because that actually might solve the problem. <laughs> I like that you keep hitting the fat jokes when you guys have fairy toast. It's literally bread. Fairy bread. It's fairy bread. I'm sorry, I got the carbs wrong. Feels like I should be the one who knows more about that if I'm the fat American, right? No, y'all be putting sprinkles on breakfast? Get out of here. Here's the other thing, too. Your food sucks. I have tried Vegemite before, and it tastes awful. It smells worse. And if I wanted a more disgusting spread, I'd ask the woman of Australia to spread their legs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Hold on. Vegemite? That's, that's a line crossed. <laughs> you can How call us pedophiles, but do not It's the one Vegemite. thing I won't eat, okay? <laughs> uh, thank you, body positive Barbie. Uh, <laughs> America has such a god complex, they're always trying to save the rest of the world. Uh, America's the only country to write ceasefire now as they launch their missiles into a country. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> 
We keep you guessing. <laughs> <laughs> Who are we going to blow up next? <laughs> I'll, I'll end on this one. I don't know if you guys know this, but Australia is ranked third in the world for meth usage. And I saw you guys at the Olympics. You should get used to bronze. USA! 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 Uh, it's, really, it's really been great being in America, but I can't wait to get home. I can't wait to have a great coffee, free health care, and an abortion. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Australia, USA keeps moving along. Let's bring up Ladies First. This is Australia. Make a laugh for Kirsty Carr. Yeah. And her opponent from the United States of America, Keith Carey. Yeah. Yes, yes. Great. Yes, if you're keeping uh, score at home, all Americans look just like this. Yeah. This is, looks like Paige just transitioned. All right. Um, <laughs> Is that it? Scissors, paper, rock. Oh, scissors, paper, rock. That. Oh, yeah. All right. Paper, scissors, paper, rock. Fuck you, bitch, gun. I'm going first. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's all right. Ladies, gentlemen, fine people of New Zealand, uh, <laughs> it's been a wonder hearing the Australian accent today, which answers the question, what if an Irishman got kicked in the head by a fucking horse? <laughs> I don't want to say Australian women are ugly, but this counts as hot there. <laughs> I'm a solid 2.5. You look like a didgeridoo. <laughs> post op, I've tucked, tucked up. I've tucked up. It's okay. The, the USA is actually the 10th fattest country in the world. Guys, they need our help. So for a dollar a day, $30 a month, you too can sponsor a fat like Keith. <laughs> to keep the cookies out of his reach. <laughs> Listen, I'm not saying Australia is a shithole, but it's the only island that can only be reached via Greyhound bus. <laughs> Seriously, I opened Australia's Wikipedia page and my computer got chlamydia. Uh, let's talk to Bus Girl about that. <laughs> <laughs> Greyhound's your favorite, right? <laughs> She's like, hey, fuck all the ladies and I'll bring you over to the bitch. That woman is too hot and has too many teeth to have ever been on a Greyhound bus. She gets it. Once upon a time, America had Johnny Cash, Bob Hope, and Stevie Wonder. Now, you guys have got no cash, no hope. And it's no fucking wonder. <laughs> Speaking of celebrities, Australia is the birthplace of many famous uh, gay people. This is true. Kylie Minogue, Portia de Rossi, Hugh Jackman, probably. Uh, I'm not saying Hugh Jackman is an Australian closet case, but he was just diagnosed with full-blown gadades. <laughs> Mr. Jackman, send all legal notices to Yeah Mad Entertainment. <laughs> and not myself. <laughs> I mean, I, I caught them as well, but um, apparently, like, there is a cure. It's, um, it's in between your teeth. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, I, I've seen corn with better dental hygiene. <laughs> Uh, surprisingly, uh, the biggest killer in the US is, uh, is not guns and it's not obesity. It's actually human stupidity. Did you know that Americans waste 32.6 hours every year standing in front of the orange juice at the grocery store because it says concentrate? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I picked on the women of Australia, but I don't trust any of you fucking weird men, either. <laughs> I feel like the only reason an Australian man goes a waltzing Matilda is so his friend can roofie her while she's busy. <laughs> he gets our culture. <laughs> yeah, when she says, that's the guy who hit me, she'll be right, mate. <laughs> well, this shit, this is our prime minister. <laughs> Mine now. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, America is actually so racist that they spell it with three Ks. <laughs> but uh, the only reason that is is because the only letters and numbers you learn in school is AK-47. <laughs> <laughs> in our defence, Australia is the home of the Great Barrier Reef. At least our country is not so racist, it's naturally growing its own wall. <laughs> 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 
Let's not act like we love the reef. You guys are destroying the reef. The last thing in the Australian Ocean with a hole in it that big was Steve Irwin's heart. So. Oh. treasures, but you just come for ours. Get him, Pat. <laughs> Fucking hilarious. <laughs> Somebody get me a green card. <laughs> Change in size. Let's go. Not you, though, but one of you. Uh, <laughs> I think that's it. That's, that's, yeah, that's five. That's a five. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's meet your next American. Everybody welcome Brian Nesson! Boo! Boo! Booze. And everybody from Australia, Rory Long! Yes. yes, meet America's skinniest USA. man. USA. And Australia's <laughs> ugliest man. Uh, I just want to say thank you very much for Nick Cannon from Wish to come on a horse dance. Bro. <laughs> I'm out. Oh. That was quick. Fuck it, I'll start it. Go on, then. All right, keep it going for a crocodile dummy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just recently watched Aussie Rules uh, football for the first time. It's pretty interesting. There's uh, there's no touchdowns in the game, but there's a touch of downs in the players. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was very funny. Yeah, that, was that was very funny. <laughs> Give it up for Paul Rudd's melted wax figure, everybody. <laughs> We're going to talk about your country. You've got to start from the beginning. So, four score and 700 school shootings ago. <laughs> a man named Abraham Lincoln knew that he needed to free the African Americans because he knew that Mexicans work way better. <laughs> <laughs> He was president for a reason, guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys, keep it going for Bogan Paul. Uh, <laughs> uh, Australia is an island of criminals, obviously. Uh, the crime's so bad, even the animals have developed pouches to store their valuables. <laughs> I like how you're talking about valuables, considering you look like you sell fake Rolexes on the corner on TikTok. I sold you that necklace. Yeah. <laughs> hey, you know my granddad? <laughs> um, I went to Texas recently, which is, which is crazy, uh, and I found out you can't really look up porn in Texas, but you can carry a gun, which makes it very easy. You can just walk around the streets and be like, hey, show me them titties, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> I almost showed him. Uh, somebody's read my Tinder profile. Uh, I saw that seven millimeter go to a nine, baby. I saw it. I don't know metric. Uh, if you type Australia into Google, you're already smarter than like 75% of Australians. Uh, yeah, the continent of Australia is like the brain of an Australian. 85% unused. <laughs> Uh, America, speaking of presidents from before, uh, you had Obama. Now, who's the next guy? Joe, Joe Biden? No. No, Trump? That's the And one. then Joe Biden? Yeah. So, it just proves that once you go black, you can go back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, one more time for Chris Hemsworthless. Okay. <laughs> Guys, Australia is the home of Uggs, which I still can't believe is what Rory calls the Aborigines. <laughs> oh, that's crazy, coming from a guy whose dad probably robbed an Indian casino. At least we gave ours casinos. <laughs> It's crazy that this country was uh, founded by four fathers, but now most of the fathers in this country paid child support. <laughs> you should have a Mount Rushmore for baby mamas. You should call it <laughs> Mount Cashmore. <laughs> Is this what you guys were talking about, fairy bread earlier? Is that what you called this guy? Okay. Um, guys, Australia's full of sexual depravity. Most of the men there can't even get off unless a woman uses the N-word in bed with a hard R. No. <laughs> 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 I 
You know what's crazy? He's so many women, he knows how to say no in different languages. <laughs> no <Nor> means no. <nor. laughs> <laughs> look, it's one of the best things about living in Australia is we get to watch the TV show that is America. Right? And we've been watching it, we've been keeping up to date. It's been fantastic, but you can tell it's getting shit now because you're about to place, replace the white guy with a black woman. <laughs> It's like Disney, but no one wants to watch it anymore. <laughs> yes, I think mean, that's five. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I'm out. No one. No one. <laughs> it's judges' time here at the Yeah Man Rose Battle between the USA and Australia. Let's meet your judges. First up, our Rose Battle League Commissioner, Pat Barker! Yeah. And Rose Battle Los Angeles champion, Nate Welch. <laughs> Gentlemen, you saw what happened up here between Sad from Australia, Paige from the USA. Let's talk to Nate first. Who'd you like? Do you like the koala bear and Paige or the bamboo stick and Sad? Uh, <laughs> man, they were both awesome, dude. I enjoyed the hell out of that battle between the Outback Steakhouse and the Big Back Steakhouse. Uh, <laughs> man, that was a damn good one, to be honest with you. All of them were great tonight, but uh, I'm gonna have to go with Paige, dude. USA. 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 <laughs> All right, Commissioner, now you saw what, up here, saw what happened up here also between uh, Monkey Man uh, Dev Patel <laughs> and the albino gorilla Paige Wesley. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it was great to see an Uber driver against an Uber XL car. <laughs> I, got, I got to learn what the fuck a Sri Lankan is. I had no idea. Explain uh, it to me after. Yeah, it's, it's some kind of like Indian terrorist hybrid, <laughs> which makes sense because Paige's blood pressure is 911 over 711. <laughs> I did think at the end of the day, it was a great, great opening battle. I did have Paige by a little bit in that one. Oh! USA! 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 USA. USA. Thank you, gay. <laughs> USA. And your Australian judges, <laughs> Maddie P and Pat Doherty. Woo! Yes! <laughs> What up, gentlemen? Welcome to America. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right, so now you saw what happened up here between USA's Paige Wesley mm -hmm. and your boy here, Sass. So would you like the jar of Vegemite or the Weetabix cereal box? <laughs> uh, that's very generous. I, uh, I didn't get that. Um, honestly, it was crazy to see Sass eat these words, and I imagine you eat a lot. So I, um, <laughs> I'm going to have to give this one to, to Paige. All right, Maddie P, who do you like, Paige or uh, a guy who looks like one of the shits she takes in the morning? <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, shit. <laughs> How does he know? What do you think the resident building? I only have eyes for one man, and all I saw was him slaying it up there, baby. Hey. He got my vote. Hey. Hey. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Go fuck yourselves. <laughs> USA! USA! USA wins the first round! Okay, now you saw the second battle up here, gentlemen. This is uh, USA and Australia here. I'm gonna start with Nate Welch. Who did you like, uh, uh, Australia's Lord or Keith, who's Lard? <laughs> <laughs> It was, uh, it was a really good one again, bro. This was, uh, it was a damn good fight. Uh, Jimmy Carr's cousin was really good uh, in the minivan. Um, but I'd have to, uh, I'd have to give that one to Keith, man. That, uh, that, that Steve Irwin joke was. Yeah. 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 That was a header, bro. Yeah, he's also never allowed an outcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad he's dead. <laughs> All right, Pat, you saw what happened up here. Yeah. Who did you like? Do you like uh, our shrimp or an Australian's version of Barbie? Um, <laughs> I gotta say, in true uh, American fashion, I think he absolutely gunned us down, and uh, <laughs> uh, there was no survivors. But the one thing about that Steve, uh, Steve Irwin comment is that yes, he got done by a stingray. I think diabetes will get you eventually. <laughs> and, uh, so, you know what? It, at the end of the day, it all will even out, but you definitely won this. No! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Kamish, who would you like? The manatee or crocodile <laughs> tea? <laughs> 
Well, I was just gonna say I've never gotten to say this to a woman before and have it be a compliment, but you are one of the most vicious I've ever met. <laughs> it was a pleasure. Uh, no, this was a great battle. No punches pulled. I laughed at everything. Although, um, if anyone asks officially in Australia, I did not laugh at the skiver when thinking it was fucked up. That was fucked up. <laughs> I don't know that at all. hundred uh, percent. All the all the dead kids you guys talked about. That that's a that's a laugh right. But Steve Irwin, what's <laughs> Uh, Everybody calm down. Everybody calm down. Yeah, their country's president. Not Ooh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> dead um, dead. But I did think it was a great second battle, but uh, Keith Carey is the embodiment of America. Everything America could and should be. He's obese. He's going to die soon. He is poorly educated. He can't afford to get his teeth fixed. He's Amen, crazy. brother. Amen. He's a fucking disaster on every level, but at the end of the day, Free. very, very funny. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm proud to be an American. <laughs> All right, you heard what Pat just said up here. Maddie P, who'd you like, the Great Barrier Reef or the Great Barrier Queef? Hey! <laughs> you don't talk shit about Australian Jesus. Fuck you. My boy gets a curse. All right, but uh, you guys all won't know who won. That's Keith Carey over there. All right, last battle was Ryan versus uh, Rory here. Who'd you like, cocaine or fentanyl? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a question for Rory? <laughs> 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 Are you asking me, right? Yeah, who you like? Uh, jeez, let me think about that one. I hate Roy. So this, is, <laughs> this is so hard for I me to say. Like no, I gotta say, he, he, I think he came through, so I'm gonna give it up for Roy. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Maddie P. Who do you like, your countryman? Do you like uh, our guy who looks like a douche, or your guy who looks like a tampon? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, look, I'll keep it short and sweet, but sure. Nurr was fucking <laughs> that, that sold me, that was it. <laughs> I'm going to get my vote. Hey! Alright, let's go to, uh, to you here. Who do you like? Uh, you know, Roy kind of looks like uh, America's Riff Raff and uh, Ryan's White Trash. Who do you like? Man, this was a, this was a fun one between uh, Special Ed Thor and Loki. Uh, <laughs> Such you should have said Loki gay. <laughs> I'm keeping it, I'm keeping it simple driver. for you guys. Uh, no, man, it was a really good one. I like the Nor, and I like the, uh, I don't know how to say it, Nor. No, Nor. Uh, Nor. I don't know. I'm from New Orleans. We don't have that. Um, but I really liked it. Uh, I'd, I'd have to. Damn, man, because I liked y'all comebacks with each other. Like you said something about selling Rolexes. He was like, nah, I told you the necklace. Um, we were that. I'm trying, I'm trying to remind myself as I was there. It's crazy because of the same accent. Gnarly. No, gnarly. Um, dude, the no, CTE I'm, is kicking in. It is, it is, it is, it is dude. I need a cigarette. Um, I'm going to give it to Rory. Wow. All right. Commissioner, who do you like here? Australian's version of Breaking Bad or America's sort of a <laughs> Can we say that over there? <laughs> huh? oh, dude, you can say on this shit. <laughs> it means cigarette. All I want to say in, in general is I heard a lot of talk tonight about how America is number one in gun violence, number one in the obesity epidemic, number one in illiteracy, and I stopped listening at number one. We fucking rule. <laughs> you guys were supposed to insult us. All you did was talk about the things that were great at <laughs> Jesus. And the one thing you left out was killing minorities, and then you gave us a Sri Lankan, a woman, and presumably a gay dude. <laughs> Do not presume. Uh, I thought it was a great, great battle. They both had great material. Uh, to me, the nur was the best part, but then the way he flipped it uh, by saying he so many women he knows how to say no in multiple languages, oh, that put it over the top for me, so yeah. I'm gonna give that one yeah. a glory. Awesome, Rory. Two to one, but Rory wins for Australia, but America wins overall, everybody. USA! 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 Mexico! 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 Sri Lanka! I'm just kidding. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Yeah, man, for coming all the way over here to get your asses kicked by America. We appreciate it. We'll see you guys next time. Woo! Thank you, thank you, thank you.